Hey everybody and welcome to another Learn to Digitize video. My name is Sue and I'm a Hatch educator and today we're going to be curvy and we're going to talk about curves. What do I mean about curves? How to make smooth curves and it's a lot easier than you think it is to do it. So let's give ourselves, make ourselves, let's create a circle. Let's go to digitize digitize there we go let's make a perfect circle and I'm just gonna do an outline and I'm gonna do it in just kind of a color we can see but I'm not gonna be using and you click and drag and I'm holding in my mouse my left mouse key I'm gonna make this kind of big so we can see it and left let go and while it's like that you hit enter and you have a pretty much perfect circle and if you are working on, you know, doing a single line or we can do something else, but let's do digitize open shape and let's do something we can see triple run and we'll do it in a really bright color like this bright red. When you're not zoomed in to the right amount, what they do, and it's easy to do, is that I'm doing right clicks, right clicks, right clicks, right clicks, and that's how they make a circle and we'll hit enter and you can see that it looks pretty good doesn't it but actually zoom right in you're off you're off on your circle on that there is a quick and easy way of doing it let's go back to my select and let's move this out of the way and it, still you can see it's off a little bit so let's do it an easier way it's much easier let's go to dis digitize open shape and we're gonna left click and we're gonna right click and then we're going to left click and that's it and that is it and you see how it went up there and I was a little bit off on my positioning but look at how much nicer the curve is than that now the other thing is if you whoops didn't mean to do that backspace uh, if you look at these two and this is nice and smooth this one is a little bit off if I needed to adjust the curve say you want the curve you know a little different to reshape on this one you got to do one two it makes editing really hard now how are you gonna get that smooth shape back again you're gonna have to fiddle around with it because you've put so many nodes on it so I've almost got it and that one's too far and almost it's really hard to do now if I wanted to do it on this one I just have one node and look how it goes you can make it less you can make it more and it stays smooth it stays smooth and that is the benefit if you're editing and if you're you're digitizing on the fly and you need to edit that is so much easier then messing around with this one and it looks way worse than before I started it wasn't too bad at first um, this one is much better so you can see the difference less is more when it comes to nodes when it comes to right clicking when it comes to making curves so to make better curves smoother curves and curves that are easier to edit use the least amount of nodes possible and that's how we do it here inside hatch embroidery software thanks everyone for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video